After a supersized tantrum, Duchesne drives off. Officers soon get their first call of the day. Welcome to Watch Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 weirdest things caught on security footage. Another theory? It's a skinny kid wearing underwear on his head. It's a little creepy to be in the driveway after watching this video. <laughs> for this list, we'll be combing through CCTV clips for all things strange, whether they be scary or just plain silly. What's the weirdest thing you've ever seen? Let us know down below. Number 10, shopping center shortcut. Have you ever been stuck in traffic and been tempted to take a little shortcut? Well, 27-year-old James Kinsella decided to take one too, through a bustling shopping center. His reckless riding caught the eye of the law as he zipped past pedestrians in Boodle, England. Kinsella carried on with his misguided motoring even after a police helicopter started chasing him. Thankfully, nobody was injured, but we're sure the shopping center's security team must have been baffled by this spy thriller-like footage. No clean getaways were made either, as the miscreant spent 12 months in jail and was banned from using the roads for three years. Number 9. Busting up a bridge. An unidentified man in the Shangxi province in China managed to break an entire concrete column with a single kick. Oh, you're a master of karate, your friendship for everyone, dead man. What's even stranger is that once the column came clean off and fell from the bridge, so did every other column. This mesmerizing and deplorable domino effect sent 215 columns into the river. Unfortunately, it is not evident if this vandal was arrested. So there's a chance that this masked mischief maker is still at large and presumably kicking more columns. We're glad everyone was fine. Um, except for the construction company that probably got more than an earful. I am never gonna financially recover from this. Number eight. Dobby in a driveway. The creature was captured back in June on a motion sensor camera outside a home in La Junta, Colorado. Well, what would you do if you saw this in your driveway? Would you call the police, the military, or maybe Hogwarts? As soon as this clip was uploaded by the homeowner, Vivian Gomez, the internet started buzzing with theories about the creature. Some said it was of alien origin, while others assumed it was everyone's favorite house elf, Dobby. Skeptics, however, questioned its legitimacy. They suggested that this creature was none other than Vivian's son, Bobby, with his underpants on his head. Bobby, was that you in the video? No. Are you sure? I'm sure, definitely. Vivian firmly claims that the video was not manipulated and that her son was watching TV beside her when whatever this is decided to drop by. Here's Bobby doing the chicken dance on a night vision camera. And here he is side by side with the creature. Number seven, delicious doorbells. Home sweet home is a phrase that this man took too literally. Roberto Arroyo arrived at the Dungan residence at two in the morning and spent almost three hours licking their intercom system. The snozberries taste like snozberries. <laughs> the owners, who assumed it was their son coming back from a midnight shift, were horrified by what they saw. The Dungans posted the video to social media, and soon the search for the hashtag doorbell liquor commenced. After leaving a generous amount of DNA at the crime scene, Roberto was eventually identified and arrested. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. It might just be us, but what's weirder than the licking is the constant eye contact. Number six, when a bear breaks in. A bear is trying to break into your chicken coop. What do you do? Big bear chase! What is he saying? What? Big bear chase me! <laughs> if you're this crafty homeowner, then you'd have something absolutely fur-raising in store for it. Haley was notified that there was some activity in her yard. It turned out to be this bear who was probably looking to grab a late night snack and a chicken coop can make for an easy target. Instead of doing nothing or going outside and becoming the bear's main course, Haley let out a spine chilling yell. 
It sounded so grisly that it confused and intimidated the bear into backing off and scampering away. Number five, a horse walked into a bar. The bartender says, why the long face? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Hey, you. Seriously, there's no punchline. An actual horse walked into an actual bar in France. Wild scene in Chantilly, north of Paris last month. Customers scattered as a young horse ran to the rear of the bar. The people inside this sports betting bar sadly got too close to the action when a racehorse escaped from the famous Chantilly race course. The young racehorse bucked its rider off before entering the bar and got captured on their security cameras. The horse's trainer says he lost control of the filly as he led it from the stable oh, to think? a race course. It apparently darted towards the betting corner before rushing back, all the while kicking furniture and scaring the other customers. Luckily, the horse didn't hurt anyone and also didn't sustain any injuries. We guess no one bet on a horse running amok in that bar. Number four, some unpresidential practices. Some stranger decided to surprise reality TV star Danielle Yancey and her husband on New Year's Eve. Danielle's husband Bart had noticed an obscured figure lurking around their home in Alabama. When Bart confronted the exposed interloper, he turned tail and ran before he could get a good look at him. The Yanceys looked at what their security camera had filmed, and let's just say they were confused. This peeping Tom wasn't wearing anything except for a Ronald Reagan mask. Ronald Reagan? The actor? <laughs> and a sock on his, well, he was barefoot, so you can guess where. The skinny naked man with a sock placed over his privates can be seen looking into windows and crawling around the porch. The police have no leads, and the identity of this sub-zero streaker is still unknown. Authorities say police are still looking for the man. Number three, doggy driving. Do, 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 dum, da, 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 dog driving a car. Da, 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 da. A crime that would even stump Sherlock Holmes had it not been for this family's security cameras. When the aptly named TikTok user living the drift life found out that his golf cart crashed into his car, he assumed that it had to have been his kids that were responsible. Only after reviewing his security camera footage did he realize that it was his dog Titan whose paws were behind the wheel. You can see the mischievous pooch sniffing the golf cart before he decides to commit Grand Theft Pauto. Don't worry, this little troublemaker was unscathed and a little unbothered by the incident. We just hope his joyriding days are behind him. Oh, stupid drunk dog! Number two, the man who didn't exist. The weirdest thing about this footage isn't the footage itself, but the mystery behind this man. He checked into the Sligo City Hotel in Ireland under the name Peter Bergman. He would have filled out his reservation form. We would have asked him for some details, his name, his address, and that he wanted to book the room for three nights. He paid us in cash on arrival. And had given the hotel his address, which was in Austria. A few days later, his body washed up on Ross's Point Beach and the police were called. Only then did people realize that there was no Peter Bergman from Austria. Most of his clothes had the labels cut off, he had no form of identification, and there was still no definite cause of his death. It just shows the level of planning, the level of detail he had gone into to ensure that he was never identified. The footage from these CCTV cameras has been analyzed by people all over the world, but no one has any clue who Peter Bergman really is. The images themselves are haunting in the sense that he remained on his own. He didn't communicate or mingle with anyone. In effect, he was writing the last days of his life. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, cuckoo for chicken nuggets. If lack of nuggets almost unleashed her ultimate form, then what would a broken ice cream machine do? The crazed customer, Melody Duchesne, went ballistic after learning that chicken nuggets could not be served at 10.30 a.m. at this McDonald's restaurant. I can't tell you how many homicides I've seen and been to, but I've never experienced an assault over fast food. She began bashing employees and blurting out outlandish things that we'd rather not repeat. As the manager hurries over to slide the window shut, Duchesne decks her one the second she arrives. 
This is the second person Duchesne punches, but the manager fights back. Duchesne even threatened to go Super Saiyan before she broke the drive through window. Unlike in the popular anime Dragon Ball Z, Melody did not take several episodes to transform. <laughs> She instead spent 60 days in jail and had to pay for the window. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.